And it is something we have been reporting on a lot recently, school bus safety. And it now appears Governor Cuomo is putting his support behind it. The governor announced today that he's including a number of bus safety proposals in his executive budget. Two on your side's Emily Lampa is here to explain. Emily? Adam Mary Ellis, the two big proposals involve cameras and seat belts. Two safety features parents, administrators, and even school bus companies have been calling for. Now, in terms of the cameras, the governor's proposal would authorize school districts to install those stop arm cameras, which would capture images of vehicles just blowing past those stop buses. The measure also proposes increasing the fine for drivers caught breaking the law. Now, in terms of seat belts, the governor's proposal would require students to wear them on school buses. While this is a big step in the right direction, the National Transportation Safety Board had been hoping for more. It had been recommending New York, as well as other states, upgrade all of its buses with shoulder belts, as well as lap belts, to better protect children in rollover crashes. It's not just that they're in the bus. They gotta be worn properly, right? And we gotta make sure that it's not the two, but the three point. Now, Senator Kathy Young had sponsored the School Bus Safety Act last year, trying to get stop arm cameras on buses. In November, she expressed her frustrations as the Senate passed this bill, saying the assembly and the governor were not willing to negotiate. Young and other supporters of the School Bus Safety Act, they were prepared to go back to bat for this bill this legisl legislative session. Now, of course, the governor's budget requi uh, requires legislative approval, but if the proposals are included come April, the hope is that the safety features could be available as soon as fall 2019. Emily Lampa, Channel 2 News.